Here is an example of my Wise Reflect implementation. We have a sound source inside of this bedroom and we can hear the sound being reflected and diffracted around the volumes and through the portals inside of this house. So let's see what that sounds like. Okay, also what we have is a door opening or a dynamic door opening system. So when I open and close the doors inside of this house, the portals get bigger and smaller to give that illusion of sound being constricted slowly over time as we open and close the doors. Let's hear that. Okay, and um, one other thing that I attach to this, I've put it on visible for now, is this white line that's against the door is a piece of AK geometry. So sound is able to diffract around the door if we end up walking behind the door like so. You will be able to see the purple dots as I move from here to here. And that is my Wise Reflect implementation um, with a dynamic door opening system. In this example, um, where our sound source is, I have changed the transmission coefficients on the floor. So when we transverse through the house and go underneath the room, we should be able to hear it a bit more clearer. So we can hear it on the floor above as well. Um, we also have a weapon we can pick up and hear the reverbs of each room as well. This is our kind of fabric -y covered room, a bit of a living room, our landing, kind of wooden door. Here in this level, I have set up a moving room where the volume is constantly changing, as we can see, which is going to change the RT60, the decay time for the reverb and also alter the early reflections. So when the room is small, the decay time should be very short. And when the room is big, nice, long and loud, which is quite a cool little thing that we can do. Um, for moving geometries or moving surfaces. And that's just a little example of that in practice.